down to roost at, at, uh, at oh. night time. But there's about 25, 30 birds. And I think it'll only be a matter of time before they really? start coming in. Yeah. But this, so this manor, this is Mr. Parker. Correct, yeah. yeah, is he the one that organises the shoot in these woods? I, Do you know? I, I have no idea. Because last last year there was about five shooters in all the woods. Yeah. And. Um, but it's his land, so I'd imagine the book stops with him. It is his land. Yeah. Yeah. He owns, oh, it'll yeah. be him then. Because you're not spoken to me, you wouldn't know me, would you? But, uh, of course I wouldn't. No, no. But yes, he, he owns the land. Of course I wouldn't say anything. <laughs> he, owns, he owns the land and. Uh, Oh, so well, hold on. Tell me your name, Cheryl. Cheryl. <laughs> your name's but Cheryl. It is. All right then. I'll say a, a, a nice lady called Cheryl with a beard. Don't yeah. No, I'll just Thank say you. who yeah. told you, yeah. Cheryl. Yeah. <laughs> no, I won't say it. I think it's probably on the general record that who owns the land and everything. Oh. Right, can you see where them chevrons are? Yeah. Just take that path to the left. <coughs> There's a little path there. Yeah, you'll we'll, we'll see it when you get, get a bit further along. Yeah. And then you just follow that way on the left-hand side. There'll be great big manor gates. Left down the path yeah. and there'll be great big manor gates. On the left hand side, yeah. Oh, brilliant, thank you. I was Googling trying to get a phone number for him. Well, you're better off talking to the um, Brightly Estates. I've tried them, I think they're on to me from last year. They said. They said you'd need to speak to the gamekeeper and he never rung me back. Yeah. Because yeah. last year I tried to stop it. Yeah. And even the police. You know, I, I filmed the guy um, shooting and the police said we went out, there's no evidence there was any shooting. It went on for 37 days. It's, just, it's just down that path. You can see we're just starting to open on the left hand Brilliant. Side. Thanks a lot, mate. Thanks, Cheryl. <laughs> cool, this. Right, so I've just come from the train station, walking down here, and you turn left down here, and then there's some big manor gates on the left, and that's where Mr. Parker lives, who owns the land. Right. Mr. Parker's manor. Get off my land. Oh dear, I hope that's not a vicious dog. No. That way. If that dog attacks me, I'll kiss him as he bites me. He's supposed to ring the buzzer for attention, but I'm not going to. Hello? Excuse me. Yeah. Hi, are you Mr. Parker? Uh, no. Is Mr. Parker about, please? Okay, no. Oh, thanks. Do I just ring on the... Yeah. Oh, thank you. Nice dog. Good boy. Hello, doggy doggy. Yeah. Good boy. Good boy. Uh, he's a good boy, aren't you? He's a good boy. Is there a pigeon? There he is. Hello, hello. Hello, good is morning. Mr. Parker there, please? Sorry? Mr. Parker. Mr. Parker, yes, who is it speaking? Um, Asher. Asher Elijah. Asher. Yeah. Is that correct? No, Asher Elijah. A Asher. It's a bit of a weird name, isn't it? Hi, sir. Sorry to bother you. Okay. Is there, um, do you know if there's a pigeon night happening this year? Is there a what? You know, the pigeon night, you know, in the wood next door. I don't know. From the 1st of February to the end of February. I don't know. I don't think so. Is there? Where, where about are you from? Well, there was, you organised... No, no, where do you live? Lincoln. Yeah, right. no, no, but you organised one last year in these woods, didn't you? Well, you better better ask the uh, keeper. I have no idea now. I've retired from shooting and all that. Oh, have you? Yes, yep. do you, Oh, do you right. happen to have the gamekeeper's name? Uh, is it the Ishtard? Or is it, it's a weird surname. Ishtard, I mean, that, you, you, don't, don't worry about it. I mean, it doesn't concern anybody else but us. Do you happen to have his phone number? No. No. Why are you wanting to know? Because I think you're an auntie. Auntie? Yeah. I'm an uncle. Don't, don't. I'm no, an uncle. 
No, because um, I was speaking to the police constable and he saw the footage from last year and um, they said it was protecting serious damage to crops. Yes. But, see, we've walked all the way around taking photographs. There's no crops growing. Tell Both me, local residents, they say there's no... Listen, Ruth, have you been in touch with the police about this? Yeah. Just recently. I know you have. Yeah, but he so wanted I've, to know. He to wanted to know the landowner. Yeah, but you. you are the landowner. That's all I we need to know. To yeah, but you are the landowner. And that's the gamekeeper. That's all we need to know. So it's the start-off. Thank you.